Hello, I recently got a comment about how I do this. Wait, 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 wrong video, wrong video, I meant this. Immerse myself into a VR experience. Um, so I can play VR while there's a camera watching me play VR and everything like that. So in this video, I'm going to show you guys exactly how you guys can do this at your own home and make some pretty sick VR clips for YouTube and everything you want. So what, you, what you're going to need for this is I tried on Android. You cannot do this on Android. You can only do this on iPhone as of right now. If you guys know a way I can do this on Android, leave it in the comments below because I would love to do that. But you need an iPhone. That's why I got an iPhone right here. Everybody knows I'm an Android person, but I got an iPhone just so I can um, do this, basically. You're going to need a tripod for the phone like this. And you're going to need the VR headset, obviously. So on the iPhone, we're going to need to download is something called Mixed. We added D, which should be right here, and on the this thing right here, this app right here, we added the mixer. You need to download this, and once you download this, then you'll be able to go in it and uh, start the calibration, start the mixed reality, and everything like that, and you can do it. For the demonstration of this video, I'll put the tripod like right here, pointed at the door, but you do not need a green screen. It will work better if you use like a plain wall or like a green screen. But if you don't have that, you don't need one. Or right, I'll just um put it here for the demonstration of the video. So you just have to put the phone in here. Hold on. Okay. After you download this app, you are going to need to go to the about thing and uh, go down here. Or if it's not here, um go to instructions and it should open up the instructions. But you guys do not need to do that because I'm going to put a link in the description that you can basically go to it without doing anything. You know, now that I'm thinking about it, I forgot one step that you need to do on the actual headset. So go to Safari and uh, go to Oculus, or you can just type in Mixed Reality and then type in uh, Oculus Crest and it should pop up. Oculus Crest. It should pop up the first link. Click that first link. And it should basically open up this thing, Mixed Reality Capture. Sign in with your account, which is not sign in with mine. Go down here, click Get. After you click Get, click Save to Headset. Reload the page and click Install on Headset. Or say, go to the Oculus app. You go to the Oculus app and install it right to the headset, which will let you do basically everything. And uh, this is the app you need in order to even do this thing. And then after you do that, then you go back to the app and then you set up the tripod. Okay, after the app is installed, you're going to need to go in it. In it, it's going to show you an IP address. What you're going to have to do after you see an IP address is click Start Calibration, not Instructions, Start Calibration. And it's just going to show you the IP address, which I'm not going to show you guys. But like, after you type in the IP address, you just click Connect. And it connects straight to the headset, which, like that. And then it shows you the steps of how you can actually do it, which I recommend you actually a asking a friend to do this for you or check for you but if you don't have a friend you can just hear the noises it makes noises like if first step you have to take the controller put it by the camera like this and just click the trigger like that did I do something wrong? I did not okay I figured it out so you basically have to put the headset on go up to the camera like this and press the trigger it is that now it's going to say press the A button, so now you have to go by where you ever want to do it. But you want to do it right over here. Then you have to do this and click the A button. Boom. Now, you take off the headset. And this is going to be this thing, you click OK. And then you see the blue thing right here. You have to drag the blue and red thing to exactly where you lined up the thing. See the blue and then the red. You have to line it up to your controller. After you do that, then you click next. After you click the next button, then you just click save to headset. And now you are not allowed to touch your phone. Repeat, you are not allowed to touch your phone now. If you touch your phone, it's going to mess up everything, okay? It's going to mess up everything. Okay, after you do all of this stuff, then you have to go over to be safe and close out of this. Then you have to go to B Saber. 
And then you have to launch the saber. And uh, after you launch a B saber, then we can go on to the next step. Now we want to go to the next step, which you want this thing to be pointed like whichever way you want it so the camera can be in the back. Like this, so the door's this way, so I'm going to put the thing like this. Now, I'm going to go back to the phone. Okay, I'm at the phone now. Now, we're on the last step now. After I do all of that stuff now, all you have to do is click Start Mixed Reality. And now, click Connect on it. And you're basically in. Do not move the phone at all. You can see that the thing is in here. Which, now that I stand up, I'm in the view. I can stand like this. Point the camera like that. Now you see a little better. Maybe a little better. Now you can you have the light signals. Now you can just wait to and it does record sound. But um in order to Now, if you have a better internet connection, which I recommend 5G internet, if you do not have that, then you can try it, it might work, it might be really laggy though, which, if you closer you are to the router, better the internet connection will be, and if you move your phone, then you have to redo that whole thing again, but, um, and if you want to record this gameplay, it is now record sound, unfortunately, so if you are recording something, you want to talk in it, like I always do in my videos, I just do voiceovers, just, Pretend you're doing stuff, pretend you're talking, and just do a voiceover after. And you can see my hand is like that. And if I take the controller, look. Okay, I have to have the headset on. Hold on. If I put the headset on, that is to count the lightsaber. Yeah, see, I have the lightsaber in my hand now. It's a little bit glitchy because of how close I am, but like, you literally have the lightsaber. And now I can play a VR game. And remember, do not touch it. And you do not need a green screen, as you can see here. And, for example, if I want to do a song, I can just literally just do this. I can click the record button on this thing. And you can only record in landscape mode. But if you want to go into portrait mode when you're editing it, you can just zoom into however you like it. But yeah, now you can stand back here. And uh, now you can see me. And now if I do this, you should be able to see this now. And I can just click maybe this song. X whatever. Now that's a little bit too easy, but I want to try to do Expo Plus just for the video. So I'm just gonna do Expo, Expo Plus. Alright, let's see this. I'm already failing. See, I failed. But you can see that it worked. Also, also, if you guys want to see what it looks like whenever you move the phone, let me move the phone right here and let me show you what it looks like now, okay? Let me move the phone up a little bit, why not? Now let me show you what it looked like after I moved the phone, okay? The lightsabers won't even be like next to each other, watch. I do this. Now, whenever I'm playing, you can see that it's a little bit more laggier. But, if you don't move the phone at all, it'll be all good. Okay, this is me after I'm done recording the whole thing. But, I forgot to say one thing while I was re you're recording the video. Is, it, this thing does not only work on BC, but it can work on other apps. These are some other apps it can actually work on. Like, Super Hard, it can work on BC, other apps, um... I don't remember on the top of my head, but these are the apps that you can play Mixed Reality on. So, yeah, I just figured I'll just throw that in. Now, that's how I do Mixed Reality. You can also do it on the computer. You can do it, 
like on the Oculus app on an iPhone, not Android, on an iPhone, they actually have their own mixed reality thing, but it's not as good as this thing. And the thing is, though, the best thing is, the app I showed you guys is free. So just go to the um, app store, download the app, and uh, go. And uh, follow every step. I am going to be putting a link in the description to go to the Oculus website to download the mixed reality um thing on the headset and if you do everything i told you guys to do you guys will be able to go in no problem and uh, just show off swinging lightsabers like who wouldn't want to do that just start swinging lightsabers you know it's cool and uh, you can even have like friends and family in the background just watching you play also and if you are recording i would say it's probably gonna be a little bit laggier because you are recording but just keep in mind you can make some sick clips so yeah well that's how you do it if you guys don't have any comments in the um if you have any questions ask them in the comments or be gladly to answer them i answer to everyone because since i'm not big i only have like 200 subscribers i'll be it'd be so easy for me to respond to you guys so yeah but hopefully you guys enjoyed the tutorial if you guys need more i can i'll be happy to make more but otherwise, you guys can see me next video or, or my B-Saber sorts. So yeah.